What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm gonna show you a very cool experiment with water. Let's get to it. For this experiment we're gonna need two beakers, duct tape, a shoe strain or some kind of rope and water. Let's First thing we're going to do is grab a bunch of duct tape like this piece, not too big but not too little and duct tape our shoe strain on it and then you see I got this beaker right here I'm gonna duct tape it inside of a beaker so the stain is gonna be like this make sure it's sold tight and glued up because we're gonna pour the water so it might unstick so just like that you see it's all duct tape to it perfect now we're gonna grab another beaker and duct tape another end to this inside of another beaker Let's do it. And then we're gonna grab this beaker and we're gonna duct tape it inside of a beaker, just like this. Then we're gonna pour water in one of this, about halfway full, not too much. Then we wanna soak it in, in the water, this stain, or shoelace, whatever you're gonna have. And this is pretty good, you can take it out. Okay, this is where the fun begins. Now we're gonna pour the water from this one and I'm gonna transfer water from this beaker to the other one and try not to spill any water and I don't spill any water, maybe a little bit but if I keep it perfectly I'm not gonna spill any water and look I can even go lower look how it's like not even 45 degrees it's slower than 45 degrees and water just keep transferring you see the water just sticks to the rope and just running down to the other beaker. Isn't it weird? Why doesn't it just fall? So now the question is, how come water is not spilling just like from the beaker? Why is it kind of sticks to the rope? Please let me know in comments below. And now I have transferred the water from this little beaker to this big one. But how is it possible? You pour in it and it almost like sticks to the rope. How does the water stick to the rope? Why it's not just dropping down all of it over here? Why does it stick to it all the way down? So let me know in comments below how does this work scientifically. What does the water has that is actually be able to do this kind of thing. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. Let me know what do you think in comments below. Very small, pretty cool experiment. And as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe to my second channel, Slow Mo Lab. Links in description or just type it in in a YouTube search, Slow Mo Lab. And I'll see you next time. Peace. And boom. But you know, let's let's see it again. So all you have to do is grab it by this thing all the way inside and put your elbow down this way and you just like go that way and drop your shot.